Kisses on my IG. Okay. So if y'all would cap, if y'all would, uh, <laughs> <laughs> and y'all just tap in, bro. <laughs> I fucked that nigga up. I ain't gonna do it. I ain't gonna do it. I just cap niggas in there. Anyway, bro, hey, our Instagram is gonna be popping up right here, bro. And we today we are on a what? Tough topic too. Yeah. Yo. Hey, I did. I did y'all like the I, first one because I, I apparently you guys kind of like it. Yeah. But it was giving it kisses, bro. Right, yeah. Just giving the hard eyes. Mm -hmm. Bro, bro. Like it, bro. All right, so to this tough topic, uh, this is tough one, y'all. This one is tough. This one is on a different level of tough, 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 tougher than my butt. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> all right, so how we gonna do this? This is how we're gonna do it. All right. All right. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go from Nelson down. All right. We're gonna ask what your idea about the question is, and you can just say a simple form, and then we pass the next person. Right. Then we'll come back your way down, and you'll explain why you chose to say what you said, all right? right. right. That right. way there's, that way everybody gets to clearly say what they need to say, That's true. and you guys can have a conversation. And we're not gonna treat I, I, this like the presidential election. This, <laughs> I, 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 I am not <laughs> Donald Trump. <laughs> and I'm not, uh, what's that nigga name? Uh, uh, I think his name like Joe Budden. Dude, oh, buddy, nigga, 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 but that's how I used to say fake news. Hey man, by the way, um, today's tough topic says, does religion and race play an important part in choosing your partner? Let me just put this right there. Just show ah. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> hey, bro. Niggas, dude, ah. it's not I don't know. gotta get soon, but soon you'll get, yeah, it's your crossing room. But hey, yeah, yeah, yeah. What you think, bro? Hey, hey, listen, for me, bro, you gotta have. Religion, bro, yes, bro. You gotta believe in Jesus. Yes, and then what was the other thing, bro? Does race matter? <laughs> race? Listen, nah, that don't matter. You feel me? My girl, I already, I already told my girl, mm -hmm. bro, if I ain't make you, bro, my problem's so over half a kind of, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Have our own life. So whatever you believe in, 
Make sure you believe that all to the end, bro, because that's where you're going to go. You yes, sir. Yeah. But at the end of the day. You got to be believe, bro. Yeah, exactly. And then also. Trump, shut up. Oh, my fault. And also, <laughs> as in race. <laughs> as in race, bro, <laughs> I don't so. discriminate at all. Yeah, bro. I really don't. Yeah. I have me a Filipino dream, you feel me? Mm. Right? Me and Bob would have Africans, you feel me? <laughs> bro, Wait, I can't read what you said. That's it, bro. He said. You going to say that louder, bro? Me personally, for the people in the back. Bye. Bye. <laughs> I'm with everybody, bro. Hey, with Joe Biden, shut up. <laughs> bye. Godly person, bro. You know, without, bro. That's the first that I actually like. Before I get with anyone, nigga, I gotta see that oh, you, my God, your God is in your life and all that shit. If you believe, nigga, God, Jesus saved your ass. That's my number one shit, bro. That's how I, I, that's how I ask every girl, like, bro. You don't believe in God, nigga. I can't believe you. I'm sorry, but when it comes to race, I don't give a fuck. I really don't give a fuck, nigga. I don't care. You need to be purple. Is. If you bad, so you <laughs> let me stop. <laughs> as long as, nigga, as long as, nigga, as long as nigga, yeah, one already. Yeah, as long as nigga, we fuck with each other. We got the same vibe. Nah, no, that's real shit. It is what it is. Nah, for sure. But Jesus, <laughs> Jesus is Lord. Jesus yeah. is Lord. Yeah, like, listen, um, for me, bro, I'm gonna say it. <laughs> My girl got me black as me. <laughs> Ain't Listen, wrong with that. Now, and when we talk religion, I should have put that first. Jesus is Lord. Uh, most definitely iron sharpens iron. Um, when it comes down to conversation, I don't like having conversation with people that's not gonna sharpen my belief system. Mm. Because some people out here are fire snatchers that's gonna take your fire from your belief and have you out here cold. So, uh, Jesus has to be a part of our relationship, has to be a part of our life, has to be a part of our children's lives. Then relationship, when I say black, that does not mean I don't like any other race. That just means when it comes down to my family life, there's a certain type of experience that as black black people, we are accustomed to and we know. So when I talk to my wife, I'm talking, bro, we, you got to understand why I act the way I act in certain situations. I don't got time for you to be following me around in the store wondering why I'm looking over my shoulder to see if the clerk is following me. You know what I'm saying? I don't need to, I don't, I don't got, I don't want that. So, oh, this should be like one of those yeah, you understand. I don't. I don't need my 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 wife questioning why I'm telling my children, be careful when you go around the police or around this certain neighborhood because they're gonna harass you. Mm. I don't need my wife questioning why I'm doing that. I need yeah. you to understand. Sometimes yeah, yeah. other races don't understand that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So that's why I choose to say I want a black woman, a black queen, a melanated queen, Great yeah. real yeah. motherfucking yeah. beauty. Yeah, yeah. In that book. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> hey man, man. No sus, bro. <laughs> hey man, but for me, ah, uh, I'm a little different. You know what I'm talking about? I'm a Christian. I believe in God strongly, like Jesus Christ. You know, yeah, Jesus yeah. is Lord on my Jesus side. Is Lord. Lord. Jesus is Lord. You know what I'm saying? And like for me, I have a woman. You know what I'm saying? And she is Muslim. You know what I mean? And the thing is, she believes in what I believe. She believes in my religion, and. <clears throat> I'm gonna put it this way. I believe in what she believe as well, which um, I was once a Muslim at the same time. So I understand that whole concept. Yeah. I understand everything about that. You feel me? So it's like, for me, I don't have a problem when it comes to her belief. You feel yeah. me? Maybe everything else, <clears throat> I don't, I don't know. <laughs> you know, like, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't go too deep. I don't go further than that. Because I know my dad was a Muslim. My mom was a Christian. So. I be, I understand both sides and you, I, you know yeah. yeah I see both sides so I understand from both sides even though like the Muslim man I believe Jesus is the Son of God for me I believe and I stay strong with my belief you feel me and that's that's all that really matters at the end of the day and 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 also race. Man, kiss ass, bro. Hey, it don't matter, man. Man, man, man. You uh, can't be charcoal, even burnt than Nelson, nigga. I don't know what fuck. Oh, that's I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Why does that come out, bro? Why does that gotta be me, bro? Like, bro. That's not even that dark no more. Bro. Man, that nigga almost look like the camera, bro. <laughs> 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 he tried, bro. He tried, Joe? Yeah, bro. Look, yeah, 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 let yeah, me shine yeah, one time, bro. Nigga, you know I'm not get his mind off, bro. Hey, don't look at me like that, bro. Hey, but look at me ass, bro. Hey. Nah, I ain't gonna lie, bro. Why <laughs> I put that on this dude? This nigga pulled me after on fire. Yeah, I'm not lying. You don't lie. You don't lie. I've been letting it for 
from your bitch ass. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, 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 it don't matter. For me, race, it, re it really doesn't matter to me. I, I, it, uh, all that matters is, like Akeem said, if you on the same vibe, like if if we have, if we both have understanding, if I don't have to stress over you, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, when I talk about stress, some women will give you stress, bro. You want stress, they're gonna fuck your ass up. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I know, it's fast, bro. Fast. But what I'm saying is that, nigga. Nah, bro. Bro. I take that back, take that back. <laughs> Everybody come with some form of toxicity. Girl, bro. You Nigga. only feel stressed when you allow the stress to get you, bro. That's fact. When you hit your disc, I don't care. Nigga, they will be so mad. Come on, son, so you tell me you don't care about me? Why don't get so mad? Now, you can go to the next one. Unless you let the stress get to you, break it down, break it down, break it down. So hey, finish, finish. Hey man, that, okay, I, I agree with that, you know, and that's that's facts though. But yeah, like as long as you have a woman that understands, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, you gotta go on the same page. When you, when I say on the same page, A to Z, nigga, like uh, I you know, I agree to disagree. That's all that matters, bro. That's yeah, let's also say that too. Uh Regardless of what race or person we choose to be with, like we we aren't hateful towards anybody. Yeah, yeah. We're just talking about who we are choosing to be. Uh, For sure, our wives, Hell yeah. people we live our lives with. Because yeah. like the Bible also says, like choose your wife. It didn't say go ahead and uh, fucking everybody you see. You know what I'm saying? Hell it said yeah. when you choose a woman, you make sure that that's your wife. Yeah. Like nigga. Technically, it says he that finds a, a wife finds favor from God. Yeah, exactly. So finding doesn't mean choosing. Finding just means that the woman comes into your life. Yeah. So fine. you know what I'm saying? Because when, when you met your girl, you probably ain't dating. You probably ain't dating. I'm with that. That's heavy. That's heavy. That's great. So what? He that finds a wife and the wife is not a good thing. It's not. It's not a particular look. It's not a particular financial thing. It's a character. That's heavy. That's heavy. I saw this video on TikTok about that. It really woke me up. Being a wife is a perspective thing. It's, it's about a character thing. Some people live lives as girlfriends. They can only yeah. be a girlfriend. Oh, they ain't yeah, ready yeah. to be a wife. Right, and that's some bullshit. I, I think that kind of leads. Like, nigga, that's what goes on in the, in the world that we are in right now. That's like, yeah. bro, that's crazy that it, that's a lot of thing going on. Most especially social media is fucking shit up for most relationship too at the same time. Uh, I want to say something. All right, when it goes back to that, I think, I think we're actually going off topic for a little bit. But actually, when it goes off to that, you just gotta sound sense to think about it. Look at African relations. Not saying that we're better or anything than that, but people also go how our belief system is also. Away from the United States, I have realized and seen that people that are away from the United States, they they value commitment to their to, to their spouse. You know what I'm saying? That's they value yeah. they value mm. they value life or death mm. relationships to where they know each other since they were young and they Died, they oh, died yeah, together. You see yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. But I saw like not trying to say America. This is all America. What you mean die together? Like I mean like <laughs> not die together. But I mean like it's for for like it's forever. Forever. It's, a it's, a, it's, it's a ride. It's a ride. So so they they go, do us yeah, part. So yeah, do us yeah, part. Yeah, it's in the vow. They go so till it's in the so the end of it. Yeah, you see what I'm like, saying? Really but I noticed like in America, like they don't go off those things. Now just bring me another topic. What I'm gonna say? Me? I don't. I'm not trying to come after y'all. I like foreigns, you feel me? The reason why I like foreigns, bro, is because they have a belief system and they have been, they have been brought up from their grandparents, which have been told that, you know what I'm saying? You marry, you marry this person, then you're gonna stay with that person. You yeah. see what I'm saying? They value that person. But as far as like the US, not saying y'all always do that. Y'all marry somebody? In 10 minutes, you don't like that person? You didn't divorce or you go fuck somebody else, bro? <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, if that person right, you buy my contract, bro, bro, you do that, bro. <laughs> That's, that's why, like, like the divorce rate is so high over here. Like, it's bro, like some people just let the they don't even fucking live. Oh yeah, yeah. Um, <clears throat> you know, me personally, uh, I would love to find a woman that uh, and let me not say it like that because you know I got a girl and shit. Yeah, bro. But I would, I would love to find a woman that you know that has you know the beliefs in God. You know, I would love to marry a, a female. I would like to commit my life to a female who believes in the same shit I believe in. Um, I want my kids. To believe in uh as God and God as well. Um I would yeah, that's the most important to me. You know that that is that is that is that is probably the most um 
thing I actually take in now. Yeah. Uh, now, let's say the woman wasn't, you know what I'm saying? Number one, I know this is like a very hard shit to deal with, but if she wasn't and I was to find myself with one like that, um, she cannot intervene in what I do and what I believe in. Mm -hmm. My kids definitely have to be, you know, a believer. You know, they have to believe. They have to be a follower of Christ. You know I, like, I like. That's, I like. That's I like. That's the two that. most shits. Now, if 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 she if she not a believer, she don't gotta be. You know, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna force myself upon her. You know what I'm saying? Cause I go to God for myself. I don't need to rely on somebody else to do it for me. I don't need. You know what I'm saying? Cause nigga, at the end of the day, it's me. Your salvation. You see what, you is see what I'm saying? Yeah. But um, I, I as far as race goes, um. That shit does not matter. Like, yeah. that yeah, shit like, does not matter to me. But if you don't, but if you, it's like, it's either way. Like, nigga, I believe in God. If you don't, it's cool. If I can bother you, it's all right. No, but one thing you would not do is intervene in my kids' shit. But that, and I want to say That's something like that. I want to say something like that because, like, for me, like, I, feel, I, 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 I agree with him, like, fully with what he said when it comes to kids because, like, I would prefer my kids to, you know, like, go to church, you know what I'm saying? Like, 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 listen to the, you know, what, like, believe in what I believe. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But the thing is, I'm not gonna force them. That's something. Like, you can't force it on them. You feel me? Like, I'm not gonna force them. But is this? Well, this is what I want. You know what I mean? Yeah. I it, want them. I would to, at least put it in front of. Yeah. Them. I want. Right. I want that to be the the shit yeah. that is in front of them. That yeah. okay, this is what I'm being told to do. And you know I want to influence them. Taught. And I want to inf. I want to. I'm not gonna say. I don't even want to say. I want them to be because I. I'm gonna say I want to influence them to be religious like I am. I yeah. wanna be a I wanna be a better influence for them. Now if they choose not to believe, what I believe. you know what I'm saying? Like it's you because nigga, everybody's been in the in that the state of mind where they decided to commit themselves to God or they decided to be worldly with it. Or like they 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 decided otherwise, you know what I'm saying? Now, me, I, yeah, I would never yeah. force my child to do any right. damn like, thing. Let me make an example. Cause like my, like I said, my dad was a Muslim and my mom was a uh, was a Christian. So it's like growing up. We went to Musk. We did. We, we, we went to Musk. So that's why his name is the King. My Sadiq. But yeah, we went to Musk, and it's like, like, but at the end of the day, it's our choice. You know what I'm saying? Of where, where, yeah. what, what works for us. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Yeah. Where, where I feel like I feel comfortable at. Where I feel like it's working for me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And at the end of the day, I felt like Christianity was what worked for me. Even though I went to Musk, like what, like ten years of my life, or what? Yeah. Six to ten years of my life. Yeah. But still, at the end of the day, my choice was Christianity. So, but what was put in front of me was Islam. You know what I mean? And I want the same thing for my kids. Like I want to put my religion in front for them. You know what I'm saying? But at the end of the day, if they end up going with Islam, yeah, I'm not gonna kill them for it. You know what I'm saying? You know yeah. what I mean? But yeah, uh, to yeah. Yeah, piggyback onto that, um, one thing we do have to recognize too, when it comes to children, is that we have to teach them some form of culture. Yeah. yeah. Oh, definitely. We have to teach them some that's, form that's of culture. That's hard, bro. That's you know. Let me get a kiss too, man. Let me pass it on to him. Pass it on to him. Pass it on to him. We had. That's not the call tree. We were trying to teach our kids. <laughs> well, you know what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but listen, um, we have to do. We do have to teach our children, whether it's religiously, yeah. uh, spiritually. Also, let's connect the spiritual to the religion. Yeah. Sometimes people just need to be connected to the Holy Spirit. Sometimes we get so focused on connecting people to verse for verse, mm -hmm. but and we don't connect them to the Holy Spirit. God is bigger than a word in the Bible. God is the word. You yes, see what I'm saying? That, yes, that's sir. the difference. A word is just a word on a page, but God is the word. He is a living testament of everything he has said, which is why he is faithful. Mm -hmm. So sometimes we teach our children, we aren't teaching them in a way where we have to hammer them in the head because God has given each one of us yeah, an opinion. And a, 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 uh, opportunity to decide. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> we have people who don't believe and people that do believe. Yeah. And what I was gonna say to you guys, when you when you come into your relationships that don't, are with women who may not believe the same way, mm -hmm. when you say I want to teach my child my way, we also have to recognize that what if your There's woman decides? There's going to be a clash. Exactly. There's going to be a clash. So yeah. what do you say? What do you say to any uh, person who's in an opposing belief now, system? For for somebody <laughs> who is in, you know in the opposition. Um, who is opposing to that, you know, um, I don't know what this, I, I, I could not see myself with somebody who, you know, would not let my children, um, our but children, then, our children, um, and, but I mean, that's where, that's at where least be introduced, that, that, but that's at where least, agreement comes in. At like, least uh, be introduced. Now look, like I said, 
Because look, I'm not gonna force my child to believe in anything. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But one thing I will not like tolerate is me being negated to at least introduce him <laughs> to you know oh, you the know guy I follow. You feel me? Yeah, yeah. You know now if 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 you're not gonna sit here and let me, you know, tell my child about me and like, yo, yeah, I believe in God, son, and you know, this is what he's done for me. And here he is, Bible. You know, if I can't do that, if I can't take my son to church or my daughter to church, nigga, you dead. Like that shit is dead <laughs> as fuck. Said, no, you yeah. dead as fuck. No, no, no bullshit. Like, no, but what if you want at least let me induce God to my child? No, what if it gets to the point where it's like the kids are like, hey, bro, dad is doing this, and but what about doing mom? At all. Hey, but look, regardless, no, but nigga, let me see this. Let me tell you this too. Regardless of how that is, right? The world works like that. They sure do. You know what I'm saying? The world is going to work like that. It's just going to be in an up close manner to my son or daughter. It's going to be in their face. Now, it's going to be either you choose to not believe or you choose to believe. What has God bestowed in you? You see what I'm saying? Because it's going to be like that around the world. Like, my daughter, my son is going to see people like that. They're going to see people who believe or who people or people who don't. You know what I'm saying? It's just going to be more upfront. And, and let me say something like for me, I think before you get into a relationship, you gotta actually lay your foundation. Yes, yeah, sir. Like that's one thing that's most important. You gotta lay down what you want, what you are, uh, your ex your expectation in that relationship, and be real about it. Not not like not like you just oh she beautiful she cute oh I like I love her blah 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 and then boom and then y'all didn't really talk about nothing shit, that serious, you know what I'm saying nothing sure. that serious before you actually step into yes, it and sir. actually make it official you know what I'm saying so it's like you gotta be real with it both of you guys gotta be on the same page and that's what I mean when I say on the same page on the same page yes, if sir. I say my kids and you are gonna follow me to church do yes, we sir. agree yes, if you say yes if you say <laughs> no, 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 Say no, you can say no. Yeah, my right. child is coming. Uh, yeah. like, 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 my child wanna come with me to church. Nigga, if my child wanna come with me to church, maybe he's gonna come with me to church. Nah, but hear me though. Before it, all right, if you're allowing that to happen, you don't even want that to happen. Why did you stop that before it even happens? But no, I'm just saying, I'm speaking no, you from got, I'm you speaking, got, I'm speaking, that means that's because, your because, yeah, 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 I'm saying, yeah. Like, but I'm also saying, if you don't want that situation to arise. What you mean? Like you're saying, in my let's say my let's say all right, let's say Isabel, right? Uh -huh. Let's say she was an unbeliever, but we had a kid, and my kid, and she was like, nah, don't teach my kid, don't teach my kid. Oh, then I would get it. I don't care how deep. Right, I but now my question is, okay, you brought that situation up. Now my thing is, why would you even let it get to that? But Black Palumi said you got to lay your foundation. If they, if it was already spoken, then because you got to get What my, my now my next thing is, why even go with an unbeliever? I mean, nigga, like I said, it doesn't matter that's, that's, for me. That's a good no, question. that's a good question. You know what I'm no, but yeah, for me, it's point, like, but... for me, it's like, nigga, it doesn't matter. Like, it, as long, I don't care about what you believe. You a grown ass woman. I don't care. But my child, and I would talk that's to her shit. like in the midst of it. Like, nigga, my child will like at least be introduced to God. You know that's what I'm saying? Equally yoked. Huh? That's unequally yoked. Huh? That's not. You guys are not together. You guys, you're messing with an unbeliever and you're a believer. I mean, yeah, that is true. Yeah, anything, that is true. Listen, anything that does not accept Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior is an unbeliever. That's yeah. what I that. Yeah. So, being unequally yoked. But there are unbelievers. Unequally yoked yeah. doesn't mean you can't be with someone that believes differently. That just means you have to be able to stand your ground firmly when you talk about your belief system. Yeah. Unequally yoked is if you're in a situation and somebody telling you their belief system, and slowly but surely you start changing your entire belief because they so strong with theirs. You're, un you're unequally yoked because when we take the yoke of Christ, we are now strong because Christ is strong. Mm -hmm. So that by having his yoke, our belief in him should be so strong that no one can break it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But unequally yoked is someone who's like, maybe you're new to Christ or mm -hmm. you haven't really established a, a relationship strongly mm -hmm. enough. Yeah, that's facts. And now you have pulled yourself away from that relationship back into the world. And there are non-believers. There are yeah, there I, are non-believers who believe, like who don't don't have a problem with their son or daughter being taught um religion or don't have a problem with you or their other spouse teaching. You know what I'm saying? I'm speaking from that standpoint right now. Like and she, if hey if my girl don't let look I'm telling you already I would not be with the woman I'm with right now <laughs> if I knew that in the future if I'm still with your ass that <laughs> my kid and stupid. my kid no I'm saying I'm making a real no, shit. I, I make a real shit like you would not sit here and try to like I don't care how early, I don't care how like you I'm going to be known right then and there like with well, my kids at least. You know what I'm saying? 
at least be introduced. Now, I'm not gonna force religion to my kid. I would not. I would not force it upon them mm -hmm. because at the end of the day, religion is a decision that you make. You know what I'm saying? You decide to believe in God. You decide whether you want to or not. Now, but if I do not, <laughs> if I know ahead of time <laughs> that God is not gonna be introduced. And I'm going my ass to church, and he right. and he gonna be at home talking to your ass. And that's what uh, and that's what and that's what I'm saying. You know what I'm it's saying? like like that's what I'm saying. Like lay your foundation. Like it's it's really mm -hmm. important, bro. Because if I lay my foundation and there's a lot of no's, nigga. Once I grade everything and I see what I can work with and what I can't. Mm -hmm. If what I can't is more higher than what I can, bro, I'm sorry, I'm not in this Beast. relationship, nigga. Nigga, it's, it's just like, like that. Nigga, I don't give a fuck who you is. Like, nigga, like, you, gotta, you, gotta, you, gotta, you gotta weigh that shit out, bro. If you're not gonna let me what's teach. not okay and the it, 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 not okay yeah. overweighs the okay, then you yeah, gotta then bounce. Not, I'm, right. I gotta bounce, I'm not in it, bro. The moment, I, the, the moment that I even get a hint that, no, you're not teaching my child this, or you're not gonna even bring it in this house. <laughs> but now my question is, all right, okay. Now. Okay. But what you say is before the point of having a child, you would have already established that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Not, that's what I'm thinking. That's, that's, that's some questions you ask. I think that's what your point is. It's like, nigga, don't even get married or have the child with the person without having that confirmed, right? Yeah, yeah. that's what Palumi was saying. That's yeah. what I'm saying. About saying that you gotta, yeah. No, nah, but like, I'm talking like weeks in, like weeks into the relationship. Like, nigga, when you start, you know how y'all play the 21 question game, but like, nigga, if, if you ask her, like, not the 21. Like, <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Like, if you ask her, like, you believe her or not, she say no. And you so, be like, all right, so look. Shawty, like, no, I'm saying like, what's your favorite no, color? No, I'm saying like, what's your favorite color? Hey, he said, Shawty, like, what's your favorite color? Because everybody's been a 21. Come on now, y'all ain't played 21 questions. Nah, I have. Nah, I didn't even listen to one now. Nah, I have, bro. I'm saying it's funny how that conversation would go. Because Shawty, if she don't believe, she going to come with some soft ass questions. I'm saying. What's your favorite food? Pizza? Like, nigga, you believe in Jesus Christ? I'm saying. So if you was to have kids with somebody who's a believer and he tried to teach his son or daughter, y'all like, y'all son or daughter, but you, would you like, have a problem with that? Would you have a problem with that, son? And she said, nigga, the moment she said, the lay at. Let me say something. It looks like we were touching up more on maybe kind of like religion and more like, yeah. you know, like yeah. children. Let's talk about on the race part. What if you, um, what if you, let's say you and your girl, y'all had kids and she's expecting her, maybe your girl, she, maybe, I'm just making an example. Uh, you black. Oh, would you want to have kids? That no, 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 no. Let's say your yes, girl, right. she's she's white and mm -hmm. you're black, yeah. right? And then you guys have kids and she's expecting a light skin. Yeah, and like, your, and now your motherfucker came out looking like Nelson. I'm, I'm sorry for thinking. <laughs> yeah. I'm still going to keep All you right, going. hold on now. You want me to answer that first? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know woman. And she, and she wanted to say, that's my fault. Everybody knows black skin. Look, look, look. If you want my son to be nice, that motherfucker come out black or black one. Look, you better love him and take care of him like he was your normal son. Cause I don't give a fuck how, what color he is. Nigga, I mean, you better love him. I think on that on the race thing, the reason yeah, why I even right. say that is cause I feel like in a, first off, in our community as black people, if we believe black lives matter, we have to start raising black lives. I, I believe there's not enough black lives being raised. Yeah, you know, abortion in our, in our community is one of the main killers of black lives. Right. Regardless of police brutality, regardless of every other issue, Black lives are dying from abortion mm -hmm. because there's a lack of uh, commitment when it comes from our fathers. There's also a lack of uh, understanding when it comes from our women. But also both parties, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know, I like so, that. Like, nigga, you're saying basically you want to have more black and the, children. The, the reason, I, yeah, the, reason I'm, like the reason I'm the reason I'm even looking percent. into wanting to have like I don't really care about race. That doesn't matter. But I would want to have a black child because I know I need to start educating young black. Yeah. You know that's that's, that's fine. And, and, and that's let fine. me say something on behalf of that, like for me, because like. Example, mm -hmm. That's fine, like bro. my girl, she's actually kind of like scared because first of all, she's already scared for me. You know what I'm saying? Based on this whole brutality, police brutality, whatever it is going on here in America, where it's like, yeah, it's just here. My fucking yeah, thing yeah, everywhere. Uh, yeah, you know what I'm saying? But it's like she's already scared of that for me, mm -hmm. knowing that you know what I'm saying. But and then also thinking about our kids. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? In the yeah, future, it's like, huh? That is something. I mean, that's nothing. You I mean, know, I, I, I ain't say there's something wrong with Doc, but yeah. I'm saying that is something I I I, I, I don't, don't want. Too. You know I want saying? my kids. I don't want to have Doc. I want my. I wouldn't want uh another thing too. Like I know this is probably off tangent a little bit, yeah. but like my kid, yeah. like I would want. I would want my child to at least you know. I want to inherit my culture too. Like if you a white woman 
and like my child come out like I would want to because originally I want to change I want to change I want to change I originally, originally want to change my last name you know as you know like, I want to change I want to change my heritage, and, heritage and I want my child to inherit like my last name and my culture so you know because I don't want I don't want my child to inherit what my like let's say she's white or you know, and it's, that's I, that's why I feel Josh is at. Like, I feel like nigga, when it comes to inheritance, like nigga, I want them. I want to pass my traits down. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. cause nigga, originally I'm gonna change my I'm gonna change my last name, everything. So it's like nigga, I want that nigga to have my. I want to I want to have, have our traits. origin. I want us to be original. This bro. is bigger than you know just traits. This is bigger than just traits. This is like information. Yeah. There's not enough informative fathers in Black lives. Yeah, that's crazy. Like, I grew up not really knowing much about my, I didn't know where, where we came from, like generally speaking, where we came from until like two years ago. Man, that shit is crazy. I spent my entire life in school not being educated about myself. Well, I got to watch as Asi Asians were being, this, this, like, this is what the school system is doing. This ain't my opinion, this is fact. Yeah. Schools are teaching Asians about uh, China, Japan, India, Korea, all these different places. But when we talk Africa, we only hearing about Egypt. Mm -hmm. That ain't where we from, they just That's say the true. West. So when, when, I, when I'm trying to get at is that now I want to raise a generation of black men who know who they are so we can establish a culture yeah, that's here a in America. Fucking bar, nigga. Because quite frankly, us as African Americans, we barely even have a culture. No, I think that's where that's what I think that's where I was heading. But we, you we, just went one did. We we barely have a culture, and yeah. because we're so outwardly when it comes to our our main cultures is the music that promotes us outwardly. Yeah, like rap music. Because a lot of times people rap, but what they what they rap is not who they inwardly are. You yeah. get what I'm saying? Which is why I think they rap more about their struggle and what they've been. But your struggle is not you. Yeah. So what I'm saying is That's because we don't know ourselves, we rap about things that aren't who we are. Yeah. Even though there are people that are murders or killers, all that different stuff, but that's not truly who you are. You're a, you're a human. You have you have a background that you may not know. Yeah. And um, yeah, so I just want to raise a generation of people who know themselves. Yeah. So they don't have to go to school and hear about slavery and be stuck. So you want to make like schools and shit, like? Oh, of course. Like I'm, yeah. I, I most definitely. I know not right now because just right now, teaching like African culture type shit. Uh, not Africa, not just African culture, because I'm not one of those people who just wants to force African down people's throat, but I am yeah. one of those people that want it to be equally represented. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? A lot of times... I feel like that is equal. Nigga, we only talk about Americans. Like, we only talk Americans. It's not, it's not equally represented. It's, yeah, you know, it's, 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 it's it. now becoming equally represented because we have the internet, but that's still not fair to the concept that some people in America don't even have internet. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So we have to remember that in schools, this is where everybody is required to go. Yeah. But in schools, not everybody is required to learn about an African. But you have to learn about Christopher. So you basically want to introduce more like about culture in the school system. Yes, I, and not only to and when we talk school, that's a different tangent. Yeah. I'm just talking about my child now. Yeah. Because my child will grow up and be one day like me. Yeah. Or hopefully better than me. Yeah, you want to be better. And he will be able to te teach people and talk to people. So I want to yeah. continue that that uh, legacy and build that culture. Yeah, and build that's that fire. That's, that's, that's fire shit, bro. Yeah. Yeah, y'all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, that's the that's the rest of what I'm saying. And nah, nah, we're gonna talk. I was going into death of why I'm saying yeah, my yeah. son would be black. Yeah. Hey man, but I know I know you guys already heard it. Like we give our own answer. You know what I'm saying? What y'all think about this shit? Whoosh. But hey man, it says does religion, race play a part in choosing your partner? Comment down below what your answer will be. All right. Down yes, below no. Another Maybe another so. Question. Yeah. Let's know if you guys enjoyed this, you know, tough topic. Part two. Part fun. three will come up, all right? So comment down below. Let's know what questions you guys have for us. And thank you guys for tuning into this video. Hey, don't forget my kiss. I'm doing free kisses. And please uh, don't forget to like, like share, and subscribe if you're new. God loves you. God bless you. And we see out of here. Yeah! Good one, Patrick.